Hello, all of my beautiful YouTube friends. This is LaShawn with Power Life Hypnosis. The introductions for the December videos are a little long this month. However, they contain some very valuable information that can help transform and change your life for the better, as well as some new announcements. So please watch the entire video. Thank you. Hello, all of my beautiful YouTube friends. My name is LaChan with Power Life Hypnosis, and this is your December 2017 Love and Romance Reading. As always, I would like to say thank you so much to all of those who have thumbs up and liked my videos. Thank you to all of those who have commented and shared my videos. And thank you to all of my old subscribers, as well as all of my new subscribers. I appreciate the support from you all so, so much. If you're interested in learning about who your future long-term romantic partner will be or your future husband or your future wife, you can visit my website at powerlifehypnosis.com. And on my website, under the readings tab, there are direct links to book readings with me. So please check that out. Also, I'm now making my new life-changing subliminals for you all. And I'm very, very excited to be bringing this service to you guys. So I'm making subliminals and I'm doing this in a very, very unique and special way. Um, again, I do have extensive background in working with the subconscious mind, which is very important when making subliminals because you really are speaking to the subconscious brain. So I am making these new subliminals for you all. So if you have any physical changes that you would like to make, you want to change um, anything about yourself physically, if you would like to get over any insecurities moving into 2018, we are going into 2018 and it would be so beautiful to go into the new year without any physical insecurities. Can you imagine? Yes, it's true. You can actually get rid of your insecurities. It's great. Um, I've done it, so you can do it too. Um, I am making subliminals for if you want to bring in a goal, if there's a goal you're trying to reach, if there's something you're trying to do, you want to bring in a job, you want to bring in money, you want to bring in anything, I can help you with that through subliminals. If you want to make any personality changes, I can do that to subliminal. Maybe you want to be funnier, maybe you want to be uh, more patient, anything like that I can help you with through subliminals. I am also doing new intuitive subliminals and I don't know if anybody else, nobody else is doing this, just me. So I'm really excited about this. So what I have been doing is I can ask my guides what it is that you need for healing, what it is that you need to clear blockages in romantic relationships. For those of you who have difficulties in romantic relationships, I can ask what it is that's maybe keeping you stuck. I can ask many different things and I can put together a subliminal specifically for you for those things that you need to be worked, I'm sorry, that, you, that need to be worked on or that you need to heal or those things that you are unaware of. I can put together a subliminal for the unconscious blockages that are stopping you or keeping you from reaching your goals, keeping you from being in your ideal relationship. Again, I could put together a subliminal to keep you, I'm sorry, to help you with that. So please contact me, um, go to my website at powerlifehypnosis.com and under the subliminals tab, you will find the information for all those beautiful, wonderful tools. All of them are on that page. So please, please check that out. I'm really excited because we're in December, we're going into December, we're going into a new year, and I want to help everyone have the best year that they can because these next years are gonna be very, very important for many of us, and they're gonna be very, very um, active years, and I'm really excited. So I would love to help you all achieve your goals and be the best person that you can be during the month of 2017. If you would like to book a reading with me to also find out how to be the best that you can be in the year of 2018, you can book a private reading with me through my website. So go ahead and book a 10 minute private reading, a 20 minute private reading or 30 minute private reading through my website. And I can answer the question of how you can be the best that you can be, how you can get the most out of 2018. So that is another option as well. If you are single and interested in learning about who your future long-term partner is, including details such as when and where you meet your partner, or again, your future husband or your future wife, when and where you meet this person, 
what this person will look like, how to recognize him or her, as well as align yourself with your future partner, your future husband, your future wife, please go to my website, powerlifehypnosis.com and book a future partner reading with me. And when you contact me, just tell me, hey, I wanna learn about my future husband. I wanna learn about my future wife. I wanna learn about my future partner. All the details are right there in the description box. I'm sorry. Well, the details are in the description box, but also um, all the information, every uh, link to contact me will be on my page as well. So everything on my website is set up to be very, very easy for you guys to book a reading. So please check that out. I'm now also on the Instant Go app. That's I-N-S-T-A-N-T Go, the Instant Go app. So if you have an iPhone or if you have an i pad then go to the app store now and download the instant go app and you can ask me a question you can ask me any question and i will respond to you within 24 hours so this is more for quick questions this is more for if you want to know say you just want to know what your future husband's going to look like you can ask me through instant go say you just want to know how to align yourself with the relationship of your dreams. You can ask me through Instant Go. Say you just want to know when and where you meet your future partner, or you just want to know uh, the letters in your partner's name, or you would like to know what is the sign of your partner. Any of these things, you can ask me through Instant Go, and I will respond to you within 24 hours once again. If you do decide to message me on Instant Go, please make sure in the initial message you put your full name, you put your information, so those are your details, your birth date, as well as where you were born, and put the first names of anybody who you are asking about. Put all the information in the first text message because that way I won't have to charge you for additional messages. So you can just put everything in one message and then from there, I will go ahead and send you an answer within 24 hours. I'm also doing dowsing services on Instant Go, which is really exciting. So if you want to know where a lost item is, I am excellent, excellent, excellent with lost items because I had a habit of losing things all the time. So if you lose things all the time, you have to get good at finding them. So I am excellent at helping you find lost items through Instant Go. So if you need to know where an item is, go ahead and ask me and I will tell you. Um, if you would like to know what is going on with your car, uh, maybe house repairs, the compatibility between you and another person, the areas in which you are compatible in, the issues that you may be having in your relationships, the unconscious things. If you want to know anything that's unconscious, you can go ahead and send me a message through Instant Go, and I would love to answer your question there. If you do not have an iPhone or an iPad, you can borrow the, friend, the phone of someone else, or you can go ahead and book a reading with me through my website, powerlifehypnosis.com. So those are all the uh wonderful announcements that i have for you so thank you for listening to those these are general readings so the messages are for everyone under the sun um everyone in the world so the messages may or may not resonate with you so if they do not resonate with you please check your moon and sun rising sign videos as those messages may if the messages do resonate. I'm sorry, if they do not resonate with you, please check your moon and sun rising sign videos. And if they do resonate with you, please check your moon, sun and rising sign videos anyway, because there may be additional messages for you. And that way you'll get a more complete picture of your love and romantic relationships during the month of 2017, December 2017. So thank you so much for listening. And I know this is really long. Uh, we will go ahead and get into your reading now. Hello, my beautiful Libras. This reading is for you. I have all your cards laid out in front of me, so I will go ahead and get started. Um, excuse me if I seem a little more energetic than usually. I just got home. Um, I'm a little excited. I was doing your reading and then I went out for some hours and just got back. So I'm still um, a little excited for my outing. Okay, so I will go ahead with your cards now. So I'm going to start with the cards on the top of the deck as well as the cards on the bottom of the deck. Oops, I'm messing up your cards here. All right. So on the top of the deck, I have the bear 
and the mice. On the bottom of the deck, I had the dog as well as the, I'm sorry, this was the top of the deck. The top of the deck is the dog and the rider. On the bottom of the deck is the bear as well as the mice here. So, okay. So from what I can see here, it looks like there's a situation in which maybe either you or your partner has been very overbearing, has been very controlling, has been very dominating in the relationship. There may have been some manipulation going on, which it seems like there's there's a lot of this that has been going on for certain signs. It's very interesting. Um, but I see here a lot of domination, a lot of your partner, you being overbearing and possibly being manipulative in your romantic relationship. There's a lot of worries here because somebody could be um, overbearing, causing some worries, causing some anxiety in the romantic relationship. So I see that's a situation that's been going on for you, Libras. And here at the top of the deck, I see that some of you have been speaking with maybe someone new outside of the relationship. I'm seeing that as a possibility. But there's some faithfulness here. So this dog card stands for a friend. So this could be for some of you, a friend brings some news to you. This could be for some of you, a romantic lover or a soulmate comes to visit you even. Because this writer card here can be a friend coming to visit. This can be a soulmate coming to visit. This can be someone who you are familiar with coming to visit or someone is just bringing some kind of news to you. If someone's not coming to visit you in the month of December, somebody is coming with to you with some news. This could be a friend coming to you with some news, a soulmate coming to you with some news. This could be some of you who are being friendly and being, um, I can say friendly with new romantic pursuits, new romantic interests or something like that. Okay, so let's see what I can see here. So for many of you here, For many of you here, there's going to be a situation in which so it looks like Some of you may have been waiting for something within your romantic relationships. You may have been waiting for something and it may cause some strife or may cause some um, worries here. It may cause some misunderstanding. So, okay, so some of you have been waiting for something. And again, it could have been some misunderstandings. These, This waiting, you could be waiting patiently and this waiting patiently could be just creating some muddled thoughts, some sadness, some depression, some confusion, um, some difficulty in thinking. This is saying watch out for drug and alcohol use during the month of December. Some of you could be waiting for the storm to pass. So it could be that there was already some manipulation. There was already some domination, um, somebody being uh, overbearing in the relationship. And you may have been waiting for the storm to pass, Libra. So some of you are waiting for this storm to pass. Um, some of you are just having patience. Some of you could be seeking advice from a friend once again. And this wisdom that the friend gives could bring some troubling thoughts, could bring some sadness, some, again, some muddled thoughts, some confusion. So that is a possibility for some of you. Some of you could be in a relationship with an older male. This is gonna be a male who is likely uh, white, Caucasian, European, 
who's over the age of 30. And this male could be causing you some confusion, causing you some difficulty in thinking. You could be having some misunderstandings with this man. Or this could be you. And you could just be, again, experiencing some difficulties in your thinking, some sadness, some problems going on. But it looks like something is bringing this problem in. So it looks like this problem has already happened because this clouds card is facing away from the other cards, showing that this problem may have already happened. So you could have been waiting for the, st the storm to pass for some of you. And this is in either an open relationship that is secret, because I have here the fish and the book. So this can be in an open relationship that is secret. This can be in a relationship where There could be a lot of secrets in this in this situation. Somebody could be wanting to be free and uninhibited as well, but somebody may be keeping this a secret. So there may be an open relationship that's secret. There may be someone wanting to have an open relationship or be free in some kind of way and keeping that a secret, keeping that a mystery. Um, someone could have, let's see, let's go with that and then I'll, go with another theme there so some of you once again are been, have been waiting for somebody or waiting for something um, or you're waiting for the storm to pass uh, because there could be a situation once again where there may be a lot of secrets in your romantic relationship or there could be an open relationship that is secret. So many of you could be um, coming and receiving a visit. I'm sorry, not coming, but this person may be coming to you. You may be receiving a visit from this romantic partner who you are in an open relationship with. But I see here that you do want some positive changes. You do want some positive improvements within this relationship so this may be a key relationship to you this may be a very important relationship because i have here the stork and the key so this could be a very important relationship this could be a soulmate as well so some of you could already be with a soulmate because i have two soulmate cards here i have the key and I also have the dog. So I have two soulmate cards here. So some of you could be with a soulmate and some of you could be possibly wanting to wanting to have an open relationship or your partner could be wanting to have an open relationship or something like that. There could be a lot of secrets that are being kept either on your behalf or your partner could be keeping a lot of secrets. However, again, I do see here that there, there's going to be some positive and ch some positive changes, some positive improvements in this key relationship. It looks like some of you may actually be wanting to fly away and wanting to get away from this uh, soulmate relationship or this very important key relationship. So this could be a karmic situation. This could be a karmic relationship. So some of you may be leaving a karmic partner and a karmic partner is someone who you, uh, this person could be considered a soulmate because, you know, we have many soulmates, but a karmic partner is someone who you need to revisit karmic lessons with. You need to get over karmic, um, situations from the past. So many of you could be, again, making some improvements through this karmic relationship or you could be wanting to be free and wanting to be uninhibited and wanting to fly away and flow out of this karmic relationship or fly away from this karmic relationship rather flow out fly away from um but that is what i see here So it looks like there could be some difficulties coming up. But at the end here, again, there are improvements, positive changes coming to your love life, Libra. So that is something to be very good, uh, something to be good, something to be celebrated rather. And also because we have this key card here, so it looks like for some of you, it could just be that patience is the key. Um, 
But we do have a key card here, and this key card represents the solution. It represents, you know, the key to, this could be the key to someone's heart, the key to a situation. So you could find that someone has the key to your heart. You may have the key to someone's heart. It says the key to the situation. So the key to the situation may be having patience. Um, this may be the key to the solution. Um Maybe wisdom, wisdom and seeking advice from those who are more wise than you are. This could also be the solution, which is waiting it out, having patience. Again, so it looks like that can be the solution to whatever is going on. Whatever's going on with this open relationship or whatever's going on with these secrets, because there's either an open relationship that's secret, there's many secrets, there could be an abundance of secrets, but there are some secrets going on during the month of December. So let me see if there's anything else I can see here. Patience can bring a lot of improvements. Wisdom can bring a lot of improvements and a lot of changes. So it looks like there's going to be a lot of changes. These changes may come mysteriously for some of you. So you may not be expecting these changes. Um. Okay. So that is what I'm seeing here. That is what I'm seeing here. But again, there will be improvements. So have no fear. Alrighty. So I also have guidance for you here. And the three cards that I have here for you are, this is Truth Be Told in the upright. Card number 14, speaking again of more changes coming. Okay, number 40 in the reverse. This is the co-creation card. And then I have here number 28, building blocks in the upright. I know these are going to be a little difficult to see because of the lighting. Okay, there we go. So let me see what we have here. So we have truth be told, co-create, and building blocks. So truth be told is saying that Honesty is needed. Clarity of communication is needed in the month of December. There need to be some changes that are going to take place. Are there some changes that need to take place? And again, this is going to have to do with being open and being honest and being truthful in your romantic relationships. So this says that, let's see what's going on here. So I can see that for some of you, some of you need to be honest about what it is that you want. So say that you do want an open relationship. Some of you need to be honest about that or say that whatever changes need to go on within you where maybe you need to be honest with yourself. So there's going to be some changes, again, going on with this honesty. Someone needs to be transparent. So that's either you or your significant other. There needs to be clarity in this communication between you and this person because I can see here by this book card that there are some secrets. There's some secrets. Somebody's not being open. Somebody's not being honest. So this could be you. Um, this could also be that you have a lot of secret. It could be that some of you have a lot of secret uh, emotions, a lot of emotions, um, a whole flood of them, a whole lot of emotions, but you're keeping them secret and you're keeping them from your partner. Um, are you keeping them from someone else? Possibly, again, a soulmate. So some of you could have been, you know, waiting for a storm to pass, maybe keeping in some difficult emotions, some difficult feelings, um, having patience, deciding to be quiet as opposed to be out loud about what's going on. And you're looking for some improvements in this key relationship. You're looking to move forward. You're looking for some changes. So these can be done by being truthful being truthful and speaking up in your romantic relationships. 
And now I have number 40, co-create in the reverse. And this is saying that you may be feeling overwhelmed during the month of December, Libra, because many of you may uh, be trying to create all that you want without the help of spirit, God, the universe, your higher power. You may be trying to create a relationship. You may be trying to create stability in your relationship as well. However, what needs to be done is instead of trying to go about everything yourself, which is going to lead you to be overwhelmed, as opposed to doing that, go the other route and work alongside with God, spirit, universe, um, whoever your higher power is, work with your higher power to co-create what it is that you want in your love and romantic relationship. So this would be I'm hearing getting clear on what you want. I'm hearing that some of you need to be completely clear about what it is that you want in your romantic relationship. So what kind of conditions do you want in your romantic relationship? What kind of conditions do you want? How do you want it to be? How do you want the foundation to be? Because I have this building blocks card here and this building blocks card speaks of foundations, eight, nine, 10. So there's uh, a new beginning. There's a new beginning here. So a new beginning in your foundation. So to build stability, work with spirit, God, universe, your higher power. Work with your higher power in order to build the blocks, the foundation, build a strong foundation for your romantic relationships because our foundations for our relationships is built on our morals. It's built on our um, beliefs. It's built on our values. It's built on things like that. And working with spirit, God, universe needs to be done in order to build a strong foundation. So this could be applying the law of attraction. I'm hearing applying the law of attraction for some of you. This could be getting clear about what it is that you want. So if you're single, this could also work with you because this could be being clear about what it is that you want in your romantic relationships. So writing down exactly what type of partner you want. This is a good thing to do for those of you who are single, especially now because we're going into 2018 and you already have a blueprint. You already have a strong start to attract what it is that you want to you. And we cannot bring in what it is that we want unless we are completely clear about what that is. So be completely be completely clear about what kind of partner you want. Be completely clear about what kind of relationship that you want, what kind of conditions that you want in your home, what kind of conditions that you want with your partner. That can be a very, very useful thing to do during this month. And if you are in a relationship, it could be useful to go back at your list and say, how are these things matching up to this list that I have here, the things that I want. So if I'm experiencing this, um, what is it that I actually want and where are these things um, not lining up, you know, and it could be useful to talk to your partner about these things and be truthful and be open and be honest. So you can work together with your partner. I'm also hearing work together with your partner for some of you. I'm building a strong foundation in your relationship. So that can also be another way that this is going. But again, truth needs to be told. The truth needs to come out. Be honest with yourself. Be honest with your partner. And work together with spirit, God, the universe. Also work together with your partner on the foundation of your relationship during the month of December. And that way you can go into the new year with a beautiful, strong foundation. Whether if you're single, this will be a foundation on who you are looking for, what it is that you are bringing into your life. If you are already in a relationship, this is a strong foundation to your romantic relationship going into 2018. So work together on that because it looks like you have the ability to solidify your relationship by focusing on clear communication. It looks like you have the ability to attract new love by being open with what it is that you want and communicating what it is that you want, what it is that you need, what it is that you expect during the month of December or moving forward in general. So that is what I see here for you, my lovely Libra friends. Thank you so much for watching this video. 
I hope that I was able to provide you with some useful guidance and messages. Please thumbs up and like this video if the messages resonate with you. Please comment, please share, please subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already. Also, please visit my website, www.powerlifehypnosis.com. On my website, I have the links to book private readings with me, and I also have the um, links in order to put together a life-changing subliminal for you. So if you go into the subliminals link, I have information where together we can put together a life-changing subliminal for you. So this would be anything that you want to change, any goal, anything that you want to achieve uh, now in 2018. Um, you want to make a physical appearance, I can help you, a physical change to your appearance, I can help you with that. Um, I can help you with healing things, healing blockages and clearing things that you may not even be aware of because I also um, make intuitive, I make intuitive subliminals where I will ask my guides what it is that you need to heal or what it is that you need within your relationships or what it is that you need. And then I will put together a subliminal that way. So I have many different options for you, which is really exciting. So please check out my website and all that information is available for you there. Also, I'm now on the Instant Go app. So if you would like a question answered within 24 hours, you can download the Instant Go app. It is currently available for iPhone and iPad. It's available through iOS. And through this app, you can look me up. My username is Powerlife Hypnosis, or there are details in the description box below to find me on Instant Go. And you can ask me a question and I will respond back Back to you within 24 hours and I will answer anything from um, you know things that need to be healed things that need to be worked on the compatibility between you and another person what this person uh, a sign a sun sign is um, what someone's letters in someone's name i can answer many many different questions for you if your car is having difficulties i can answer that for you too any house repairs whatever you need you can go to instant go and you can ask me and i will respond within 24 hours if you would like a private reading with me if you would like a um if you would like a future partner reading with me or a specialty reading with me that's the word i was looking for you can go to my website powerlifehypnosis.com and i would love to um do a reading for you so thank you so much again please subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already and thumbs up to like this video i'm looking very very forward to seeing you all here again soon for the 2018 readings which will be posted so thank you again and i will see you all here very very soon bye guys